four, three, two, one, zero. At T plus 40 seconds, we've got a beautiful view of Falcon 9 successfully lifting right, off tree is nominal. from pad 39A at Kennedy Space Center, carrying our stack of Starlink satellites to orbit. And we are throttling down the vehicle, uh, the engines in preparation for max Q or maximum aerodynamic pressure. This is the largest structural load that the vehicle sees on ascent. So slowing down the vehicle helps us pass through the short period. Max Q. And there's that call out that we've passed through mass, max Q. Now, in about a minute, we'll have three events happening. That'll be main engine cutoff, or what we call MECO, stage separation, and SES-1, which is second engine start one. Now, MECO is where we shut down all nine of those M1D engines on the first stage to slow the vehicle down in preparation for stage separation. And that's where the first stage separates from the second stage. First stage will start making its way First stage will start making its way back to Earth for landing, while second stage continues on its journey with the third event, which is SES-1, or second engine start one. And that's where we... Zero. Ignition. And lift off. New bolts pitching downrange. Stage one chamber pressure is nominal. plus 43 seconds into flight. Falcon 9 has cleared the tower and is currently throttling down to prepare for max Q at around the T plus one minute and 12 second mark. Max Q is where the vehicle will experience the highest amount of aerodynamic pressures. Falcon, Falcon 9 is supersonic. Q. And we've just passed Max Q. That is a really cool tracking shot of Falcon 9. All is looking good with the Stage 1 trajectory. Uh, in about a minute, we have three events coming up in quick succession. Two, one, zero. Ignition. And lift off. Pitching down range. Stage one chamber pressure is nominal. Pitching downrange.
at T plus 40 seconds into flight, Falcon 9 has successfully lifted off from Space Launch Complex 40 at Cape Canaveral Space Force Station, carrying our stack of Starlink satellites to orbit. Now we are throttling down that first stage in preparation for MAX-Q. MAX-Q stands for... Two, one, zero. Ignition. Stage one chamber pressure is nominal. Three, two, one, zero. Ignition and lift off. Stage one propulsion nominal. is pitching downrange. Falcon 9 has successfully lifted off from Cape Canaveral Space Force Station, carrying our stack of Starlink satellites to orbit. Nominal power and telemetry. Max-Q is the next major event coming up here shortly, which will now be throttling down the engines, the M1D engines on that first stage for. Max-Q is the maximum aerodynamic pressure that the vehicle sees on ascent. Vehicle is supersonic. And the weather, again, is looking beautiful, clear skies with an amazing view of Falcon on ascent there. Max Q. There's that call out that we have passed through Max Q. So in about a minute, we'll have three events happening back to back. That'll be main engine cutoff, or MECO, followed by stage separation and SES-1, or second engine start one. Now, MECO is where we shut down all nine of those M1D engines on the first stage that you see burning there on your screen. That's in preparation for the second event, which is stage separation. MVAC is chilling in. Just heard that call out that MVAC chilling has begun. Now stage separation is where the first stage separates from the second stage. And first stage will make its way back to Earth and attempt to land on our drone ship, of course, I Still Love You, while stage two continues on its journey with the third event, second engine start one. That's where we light up. One, zero, ignition, and lift off. Godspeed, Apollo 11, Michael Connell, Colin. May the pursuit of exploration went on. Vehicles pitching downrange. Stage one propulsion is nominal. Zero. 
ignition. And lift off. May the force be with us. Stage one chamber pressures are nominal. Vehicle is pitching downrange. Plus 40 seconds into flight, Falcon 9 has successfully lifted off from our pad 39A at the Kennedy Space Center, carrying a Normal stack of Starlink launcher. satellites into orbit. One, zero, ignition, and liftoff. Let's go, Falcon, for number 10. Pitching down the Signal and chamber pressure is nominal. Pitching down range. As you can see, Falcon 9 has successfully lifted off from the historic launch pad 39A at Kennedy Domino Space Center, telemetry. carrying our stack of Starlink satellites and two ride shares into orbit. One, zero, ignition, and liftoff. Vehicle is pitching downrange. downrange. First stage chamber pressure is nominal. We are T plus 42 seconds into flight. Falcon 9 has cleared the tower, and we're currently throttling oh, down in preparation for max Q. That should be coming up in about 20 seconds. Max Q is where the vehicle will experience the highest amount of aerodynamic pressure. Three, two, one, zero, lift off.
one, zero, ignition, liftoff of the Falcon 9, go Starlink. Stage one chamber pressures are nominal.